Thank you. Um, how does that sort of play with the club? Because I know it's been a weird time now too. Really, um, I guess, you know, the club of the media as well as well. I think we were able to, it was probably similar to, to the back end of yesterday. We probably just found the rewards a little bit quicker. Um, I guess this morning it was just about putting the ball in good areas for long periods and we're able to do that this morning. Um, you know, we spoke about uh, yeah, I guess how, how yesterday unfolded and um, and Tim gave us a good chat this morning before we went on the field and just around how we wanted to operate this morning and you know, we were able to do that and um, yeah, I guess get some rewards from that. Um, oh, I guess, yeah, I probably learned a little bit around um, tactically what I'm trying to do. Um, yeah, the ball certainly swung a fair amount and probably at times almost too much. Um, so I think, you know, for me personally today and, and a little bit yesterday as well, I tried to probably more wobble the ball than swing it um, and just kind of engage guys for longer periods. And I think, um, especially when the ball gets a little bit older and the seam's still pretty good um, on the Duke's ball. So... So I think just tactically how you're trying to operate the guys and when you wanted to swing it and how much you want to swing it and which way you want to swing it as opposed to just, I guess, New Zealand where it doesn't um, tend to move as much in the air and um, instead of guys playing and missing, you tend to grab the edge a little bit more. Oh, yeah, I mean, it's, yeah, you're pretty fortunate to be in that position and I don't think you ever go out there when you bowl to try and take three in a row. You're just trying to put the ball in the right area and see what happens. And um, credit to credit to Mum and Shami, he played a pretty good cover drive off that third one. So, uh, yeah, you've got to gotta take some credit there. But, yeah, I guess it's just good to, good to contribute and um, nice to, I guess, wrap things up quite quickly. We know um, how niggly at times, uh, I guess, low order batters can be. So to... So to wrap that up in the fashion we did was pretty pleasing. Thank you. Oh, that was superb. I think that's, you know, from my, I guess, short time in this team is was some of the best band that I'd seen. Um, I think the way that Tom and Dev approach that the ball you know was going to move around we knew that and um, the conditions were probably going to be in the bowler's favor the way they approached that um, you know pretty tricky period was outstanding and you know I think you know they're pretty uh, two pretty world-class openers in my opinion anyway and the way they tackled that uh, built a partnership um, and yeah got us to where we are was yeah was certainly pretty special. Yeah, I, yeah, to be fair, I haven't seen the forecast a huge amount. Um, obviously, we've got a little bit of time up our sleeve with that six days, so um, be interesting to see I guess, how that plays out. I think where we're sitting now would be pretty comfortable. I think if you said to us at the, you know, at the start of the game that we could get them for you know, low 200s and then to be 100 for two, we'd be pretty happy. So um, you know, we'll have to see how the, how the, guess, the next day or so pans out, but we're certainly in a... Um, I guess a position that we'd like to be in um, in terms of moving this game forward. Oh, I guess, yeah, m maybe there's some sort of pattern. I don't necessarily know if we talk about a huge amount. I think, you know, the one that I was able to get in with today certainly seemed back a little bit. And 
those are pretty hard to control as a bowler and pretty hard to, to manage as a batter, no matter who you are. So I don't think it's necessarily just for him. But, um, yeah, he's obviously he's a massive part of their team and um, a pretty big uh, yeah, pretty big wicket to get. So um, to get him pretty early this morning was, yeah, I guess was nice and was pleasing and um, pretty crucial for how the day unfolded. Oh, not really. I think you know he's a world class batter, and those guys don't tend to have too many chinks in their armour. Um, yeah, certainly pleasing, pleasing to get him. Like I said before, I think you know he's obviously a massive part of their lineup, and um, to get him early certainly set things up nicely for us. Um, I guess it was pleasing in terms of um, you know for myself being able to try to wobble the ball and try and keep him um, in check a little bit, and to get that wicket was. Yeah, it was pleasing and it was just a great start for our day. We spoke around, you know, how we wanted to operate this morning and how uh, important today was going to be in the context of the game. So to start that way was, yeah, it was obviously, um, yeah, it was pretty pleasing. Yeah, I think I think the uh, the team culture and the environment that has been created um, over a long period of time certainly um, is one of the strengths of this team, and it allows guys. You know, I certainly um, have you know been pretty comfortable coming to this group and just being able to go about your business. And um, you know, I think also the fact that you've got some pretty world class guys around just sort of allows you to just to just settle into your role and. Um, yeah, I mean, I can't, I can't necessarily speak for Dev and, um, in terms of how he feels, but certainly for me, it's been, it's been an absolute pleasure coming to this group and just being able to um, go about my business and um, you know learn off these guys and um, yeah, I guess just ride the coattails of them a little bit in terms of um, you know the pressure they build and, and the runs they score and yeah, I, yeah, I can't really speak highly enough of of, um, of the environment and the culture that. You know the guys have built over a period of time, and um, certainly made I guess my transition into international cricket, um, yeah, pretty easy. Yeah, it's good. I think you know it was certainly a tricky period, and like I said before, I think the way that Tom and Dev um, went about their business at the start and sort of set the platform, you know, for us and, you know, and then obviously Kane coming in as well and um, and him just doing Kane things really. Um, yeah, it's it's good and it's important and we spoke about today being important in terms of putting the ball in right ears and, and getting wickets and then obviously off the back of that we had to start well with the bat and, you know, we're able to do that and, you know, whatever unfolds in terms of the weather or, um, you know, bad light or, or whatever, we can't really control but we can control how we choose to operate and, how we tackle each moment, and um, obviously today was it was a pleasing day from that front. Um, good evening, Kane. Hello, how are you? Yeah, I'm doing fine. How are you? Congratulations on fighting that one. Thank you very much. Um, well, it's probably a little bit early to say what sort of lead. I think you're always hoping for, for more of a lead or as much of a lead as you can get. I don't think you can really put a number on it. Obviously, we've seen that it's been tough and and we know in England that things, when they happen, can happen quickly. So, you know, the way we started tonight was obviously, you know, was pretty good in terms of that front. We didn't, um, you know, things didn't happen too quick and we were able to build a pretty solid foundation, I think. 
obviously the key moving forward is to try and build on that and you know if we can get ahead great if we can get 50 100 150 great i think as a bowling unit we'll you know we'll take whatever we can get really but um yeah we've seen that it's not it's not easy it's not easy batting conditions and with the class of this indian bowling lineup we know that it's going to be tough so we know again it's just going to be about trying to win the moment and, and to stay in the moment if we can do that you know whatever lead we can get to if we get there and um, and then build on will be great thanks guys